Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Pony Boy Plays Octopath Traveler 2. Uh, I apologize for the last episode of Final Fantasy IV. My microphone uh, frigged up. The volume just went way down, and I don't know why. So I jacked it up full. I did a test run, and uh, you guys can hear me. I might be a little louder than the music, but when I shut up, you can hear the music. So, uh, in this episode, um, we're going to do a little quick little thing here, but first, travel banter. I almost forgot, I for, almost forgot. It seems to have a weird liquor in stock. The bartender said it's a bit on the strong side. I would be happy to give it a try. <laughs> None for me, thanks. I'll have raspberry juice. I hope you do not mind us partaking in alcohol in your presence, since... And Gia. Not at all, I don't drink. But I'm happy to spend time with folks who do. Everyone I know becomes so cheerful when they're drunk. Uh, I know some people who don't. And you get to see a side of them you don't usually see. <laughs> uh, you see the good in everything, don't you, Angia? Now then, shall we raise our glasses in a toast? Cheers! Cheers! Where everybody knows your name! Hmm, what a delectable flavor. Indeed, I think I'll have another. I never took you f uh, for much of a drinker, Casti. Me neither. I don't know why. Well, she's southern. I thought you'd consider it poison for your body. <laughs> Everything in moderation, even in alcohol. But perhaps you've had a little too much. You have a distant look in your eyes. That's not true, okay? <laughs> Are you all right, Casti? You seem like you get pretty giggly when you drink. I don't know. I forget the voices. Cassie, where are you going? Blah! So hot in here. <laughs> I think I'll get some fresh air outside. Don't wander off, Casty. Help me, Akiri. You needn't worry, Angela. On my honor, I swear no harm shall fall before you or Casty this night. Akiri? Okay. Is the liquor that's gotten you more serious than usual? <laughs> it's never a moment in this tavern. Alright, radical. Okay. Um. There, right, get the day going. Um. In this episode, we're going to start doing some of the the crossed paths. Uh, um. So we're going to go to Ryu, and since we have two of the characters already, of uh, um, a kitty and Agnia, I I kept calling him Ngia. Jesus Christ. Uh, that's what we're going to do this episode. I don't know if these are needed. That's right, I had business here. During the quiet night in Ryu, Agnia and Akiri hear the sounds of a beautiful instrument drifting off in the wind. Level 8. Yeah, let's do it. This should be pretty quick. It's nice to see. Hey, Hikari. You hear that? What a pleasant sound. I could listen to it all day. But we're in the night, so turn that shit off! That's a lute. An instrument well-loved in Ku. Play Stairway to Heaven! Oh, we're not taking requests? That song was beautiful. It was about my all my dead children. Thanks for calling it beautiful. It's been too long since I've heard the melodies of a lute in the air. Far and wide, people speak of me in awe. Today, tomorrow, and the day after that. Ah, oh, Jesus, we got somebody with an ego. Great. They call me Yomi of a thousand tongues. Wow, what a name. It doesn't sound pretentious or made of bullshit at all. Travel to every corner of this world, taking in my fill of its music along the way. I have a song for every occasion, every place, every person. You've piqued my interest. Let's have one then. Gladly, provided you have the coin. My thousand tones were mastered with great effort. After all, I do got a lot of money. Do you have 
money, right, Hikari? Uh, I thought you carried all the money. Fuck! So it begins. Bribe. Okay. Um. That's rest. We don't need that. What do you got? You got anything good for me? Oh, uh, music. You know what? I, I was gonna do a side quest of where to buy all this stuff, but I don't want to lose it, so let's just say, here you go. Anything good here? Bye. Let's just spend some money. Why not? Because I highly doubt everybody would need to wear it all at the same time. Um, I think we're okay here. Nope. I'm not doing that. Uh, actually, hang on a sec. Who needs more experience? Um... Uh, 68, 74... Agni... 60, um... You know what, Oswald? Even though I don't know if I'll ever use your stuff, throw an A. You're in. All right, there you go. Why not? There you go. Eight hundred bucks. This do. A loot is well known to those in the desert as Yomi of a Thousand Tones. She knows a great number of songs and has wi has been widely praised for delivering tailored performances that has moved her um, <clears throat> her listeners' hearts. All right, cool. Is this enough, Lady Yomi? Of course, this shall buy you a song. A five-second song. One that will fit you as well as your finest kimono. However, You'll find this key kimono or whatever is fucking is horrible. I require time to make ready. Return to me tomorrow eve, and you shall have what you paid for. Uh, I, I feel like this is a scam. Behind every great show is hours of preparation. Well, if anybody would know that, it would be you. So, hmm. Just so. Now gird your hearts. For tomorrow, they shall be moved as they never have been before. Wait until the following night. Okay. So, what I could do is this. That's probably the best way to do it. What about now? Okay. Okay. I'll do this. First aid. No, we don't want that. Um. Yoink! Yoink! I'll take that. Nothing. Okay. I hit an item. Okay. Sweet. Give me it. Oh, I can't carry more of it. Okay. Night time. Here you go. Welcome, welcome. My audience of two has arrived. That's twice as my normal amount. Now, listen well and be carried away by my thousand tones. Watch her be like, um, like she'll hypnotize me, like some bar D and D shit. Hmm? 
something seems different about her, doesn't it? Different person. Yes. It appears she's already spent our payment on those fine clothes. Alas, I must apologize. For I cannot carry you away just yet. Yeah, you're a scam artist! I knew it! I come into a spot of trouble, you see. Oh, suck my dick! You have? No, don't be so kind to her. Look here. The strain of my loot has frayed. Without replacements, I'm here. <laughs> song will have to wait indeed it is tantamount to asking a soldier to charge into battle with a broken sword i'm gonna break my sword off sword off in your ass if you mm. oh, we wouldn't want that happening don't indulge her if i recall loot strings are made from the hair of a horse's tail yes and we'll just kill the horse indeed there is but one man nearby with the means to help, but he is not one to offer his aid lightly. Scam artist! no truck with a wanderer such as I. He scarcely acknowledges my existence. Oh. Oh no. Reminds me of Papa. Then maybe you can help him see reason. Can I count on you? You don't need to ask. I'll see what I can do. All right, so do some. No, oh, you can have it. Here you go, asshole. There. You have the dress. You have a. This work, Yomi? You have the dress. You have a fixed loot. For fuck's sake, play me my goddamn song. I'm putting on a coat because it's a little chilly where I am right now. There you go. I believe it will. This is finer than I could have imagined. But yet I have more bullshit problems. I see you too can move the hearts of others. And, uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> you might be right about that. And with this, I can craft a string worthy of my skill. Less yakety, more with the music. However... The moment is not ripe for such a performance. <laughs> Play come again tomorrow, and I promise that my melody shall lift you to the heavens. This spell, or this, yes. <laughs> so now I'm not surprised. The wait will make the music sound all the sweeter. Be patient, Kikari. Or I'll be more disappointed. If you insist. You're generous with the benefit of the doubt, I see. I'm not. Alright, so... Whoop! Whoop! No? That doesn't do it? Alright, so... Let's do another rest. Where is she? Hey, fuck nuts. There, there she is. And I was just fucking around. Oh, welcome, my honored patrons. If you do not play me my song, I'm going to fucking suplex you off this cliff. We were looking for you. Do you ever stay in the same spot? Of course not! Why, I, why would I want to be discovered? My sincerest apologies for the trouble. Mm-hmm. However, I had no choice but to go where I could best drink in the beauty of tonight's moon. Uh-huh. And now I will turn into a werewolf! You're right. It's enchanting. I wanted its dulcet rays to alight upon my loot. 
as I played your song. Uh huh. Tonight, I perform upon a stage like no other, with string and guard equal to the occasion. All thanks to you, my most honored audience of two. I hope this is worth the trouble. It will be, I assure you. Now, listen. Now she'll play the song and will fall asleep, and all your items and money are stolen. It is, like, pretty. As night heralds the end of day. I have no idea. Um. The mirror beckons for the grace. No, I'm out of tune. Um, no, Final Fantasy VI did the music scene a lot better. Beckons you. I would much rather them have to put a little extra voice acting into this. I've never, I've never heard such a song before. You shouldn't have. I made it up on the spot. I was moved. But somehow... Incredibly underwhelmed. I feel so... So sad. By the light of the heart. A favorite of mine. The clothes, the strings, the moon. And they must be just so. Ah, so you weren't scanning me. way to perform this song correctly. Yomi, why did you choose this song to play for us? Yeah, I needed the money. I've heard it before. Before the fall of Ku? I had a friend who would often play the lute for me. She always struck warm tones to match the warmth in her heart. Her name was Suki. Uh, was? Yeah, you played the song much differently than she did. Well, music is open to interpretation. You painted it with melancholy. Well then, our business is concluded. I shall take my leave. So ends Dancer and Warrior, part one. Oh, I saw, okay. So. Oh, how do I get out of here? I do believe that's kind of the end of the tale. Yeah, these are just short little, like, um. Like, um opening things. Okay, so. Let's see here. 16. Who's Who will be next on our next episode? That was a very short... An 8. Okay. And what are you? 16. Alright, so we got two 8s and a 16. So our... Um, I'll do a quick save. And we will... Um, be right back with uh oh dang it i freaked out <laughs>
Oh, that's not uncommon in Pony Boy Plays. Uh, who's that? Oh, Oswald and... And, uh... Uh... Oh my god! I'll show you who the fuck I'm talking about. Him? And, um... Him. Oh my god! Yeah. Okay. Alright, let me just organize... 69, 69. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. So, uh, Perticio and Oswald. So that will be our next episode. So, uh, yeah, you know the drill. Follow me here on YouTube, Pony Boy Plays. Follow me on uh, Twitch and Kick at uh, their website slash Pony Boy Plays. Uh, Twitter or X. I still, I'm always going to call it Twitter. At Pony underscore Boy underscore Plays and TikTok at Pony Boy Plays 1985. Because that's the year I was born in. Because I'm an old fuck. Anyways, thanks a lot for watching, everybody. And I'll catch you guys on the next episode of Pony Boy Plays Octopath Traveler 2. Take care, everybody.